Uh, you've been with this team now for just two series, but you're also part of the first walk-off win. You scored the run in the bottom of the ninth inning. What did it feel like to, to have the emotions of winning walk-off in your first game here at Coca-Cola Park? Oh man, it, it felt great uh, just going out there and you know <laughs> getting a hit to put me on uh, first, and you know we got a got a big hit by Sellers. You know I was just trying to run hard and. You know, we end up with the victory. I don't know what happened out there in center field. I guess he stumped on it or whatever, but, you know, I was just glad, glad we didn't have to go to extra innings. Now let's talk about game two because you hit a home run in a 0-0 game for your first at AAA, but it, it was no home run to us. I mean, that thing was an absolute bomb. I mean, compare that to some of the best balls that you've hit in your minor league career. Uh, I mean, I, I hit it pretty good. I really didn't watch where it went. Uh, the ball in, that I hit in spring training against Berlin, I, that's, that's the top for, for me. But uh, I hit the ball pretty good. I saw a curveball up and took a good swing at it. Yeah, it was an excellent swing. Uh, obviously, you timed it perfectly. But a lot of fans have talked about your defense. And, and I mean, your offense. You hear about the offense of Dominic Brown. But last night, you brought this place to their feet. I mean, literally, you threw one guy out at third, but then you very nearly got a guy at the plate with a perfect throw. Uh, talk about your defense and how much pride you're trying to take into that as well. Oh, man, I take a lot of pride in my defense. Uh, I've always been pretty good defensively. I'm, been working hard at my offense, man, and ever since I've been in pro ball, that's what everybody knows is, is my offense. But growing up as a kid, I always had a pretty strong arm and, you know, like to show it off, as you can see. No doubt the fans really enjoyed that. What did you think of your first experience here at Coca-Cola Park, the facility, and, and of course the fans as well? Oh, man, it was electric last night. I think we had 10 plus or whatever last night. It was it was great, man. It's, it's uh, a new ballpark, man. It's not, it's, it was like Redding and, you know, the historic place, but, you know, Great fans, it was electric, and you know I'm glad we came out with one victory out of you know two games. So we'll, well it was certainly nice to get that walk off, something that we've been waiting for. Now today's morning call, they have not even on the sports section, the actual front page is the prospect, and it's a picture of you and a story about you. I mean, I've talked to you about this before, all the hype, but I mean, right. how do you keep a level head and just keep going at it day in day out like you've been able to do so far? Oh man, just looking at my teammates and you know what all we got to go through is it's no it's no big deal coming in here and just. Staying level-headed, uh, that's how I grew up, you know, a hard-working family. And, you know, I just take that into my, my work ethic every day. I come in and work hard and, you know, take it day by day. The prospect thing doesn't mean a thing to me. But then to live up to the expectation here, everyone coming out to see you, your first game, we had 10,000, a capacity crowd yesterday. Did it feel extra good to, to know that you came through with a good game with people here, you know, wanting to see Dominic Brown? Oh, of course, of course. It felt good to get a, a couple hits in my first game and, you know, throw out a couple guys. And, you know, still a base. It felt it felt great to play good, man. As you know, when you're playing good, it's, it's fun. It's fun, and we got to win, so this is also, you know, very exciting. All right, well, let's hope for more of that tonight. Uh, good job, us at Dominic Brown. Keep it up for us. All right.